Hi guys, welcome to the OV Academy. Today topic is difference between MySQL and SQL Server. Let us see in the one by one what is the difference and uh, how we can use it and how we can check the addition on the detail one by one. And uh, what are the language it is going to support for the MySQL is C++, Java and uh, runtime support for per TCL and Haskell it is going to support. When coming to the SQL server and it is going to support C++ and Java, Ruby, Visual Basic, Delphi and RR supported by SQL server. And coming to the who own this uh, MySQL and the SQL server is MySQL is owned or the developed by Oracle and SQL Server who own it, Microsoft is owned it. Okay. And these are the two difference. Let us move on to the next, uh, next difference and uh, canceling the query. The while uh, running the, we will be executing the uh, query. The query has the uh, big line of the code and uh, in order to uh, we need to stop that. Whether the MySQL is going to support the stopping that query or not, SQL is going to uh, uh, support or not. Let us see the difference. The MySQL does not permit the canceling the query execution midway. And uh, in other hand, SQL server will permit canceling the query execution midway. Okay. And uh, that is the difference and uh, let us move on to the next difference the coming to the storage space and uh, mysql if ether it is require the more amount of the space to store the uh, data or not and uh, sql server need the more data let us see the difference and coming to the mysql it requires the less amount of operational storage space as compared to the sql server and uh, uh, SQL Server, it needs large amount of operational storage space. And uh, coming to the other difference and how we can uh, do the data manipulation in the MySQL, whether the data manipulation is allowed in the uh, these two databases or not, let us see. In MySQL, while it is running, data file can be changed. And... Uh, when coming to the SQL server and under the security consideration and running data file manipulation is not permitted. Here in the SQL server, once the data uh, due to the security uh, security concern or uh, data manipulation is not permitted, in case of MySQL, we can do the uh, data file uh, while running the query, we can do the some modification to the file. Okay. And uh, we can, uh, why uh, we, uh, we can discuss about the other uh, difference is the backup. And uh, while taking the backup of the MySQL and SQL server, whether the database is going to lock or unlock. Uh, we'll discuss that. Why the database is required? In case of the something had happened, someone has deleted our database by mistake. During that time, we need to recover the data. How we can recover the data? If the previously backup is there, means the we are able to uh, recover that data. Okay, that is the reason we are going for the data backup. Uh, data backup in the sense like the hourly basis and uh, one day basis and uh, we are going to do the backups. Okay, there are the different types of the data backups are there like the incremental backup and other backups are also is there. I will uh, explain that into the some other videos. Okay, let us move on to the next difference, the cost. Okay, and uh, what is the cost is associated with the MySQL and SS, uh, SQL server is. And uh, MySQL is server is, it is a pre, pre to use. There is a no cost associated with no need to pay any single rupees for this MySQL. Okay. And coming to the SQL server, it is the costly and we need to pay for this. 
okay and uh, move on to the uh, next difference and additions and what are the additions are available in the current market in the mysql and sql server let us see and uh, coming to the mysql we have the enterprise edition standard edition and cluster grade edition we have in mysql and when coming to the SQL Server, we have the standard enterprise and uh, web workroom or express edition we have in the SQL Server. These are the all the difference. And uh, whenever the interviewer asks the questions, like the what is the difference between my SQL and uh, SQL Server, you can explain the any payu out of this eight and uh, it will be good if you explain the all the differences but if you remember the payu and if you tell no it will be very good and uh, they will give you the good amount of uh, uh, marks for this okay thanks for watching this video guys uh, see you in the next video thank you